they've got a prompter. Right now they go to something else, and now they can they don't have to really interact now. Now they've got about 60 seconds to either listen to the producer, type away, or do other stuff. <coughs> yeah, we are with Sarah. I'm with Sarah since uh, August. Yeah. Yeah, we've, we've been around for a while. Sarah, you're the greatest multitasker of the history I've ever seen. Good job. <laughs> oh, right. Some days I do it well, and some days I don't. That's for sure. It's so. unbelievable. You're doing great. Is this your first time you've been in here, Chris? I'm actually watching the newscast, yes. I didn't know you did it during the newscast. Okay, thanks a lot, Melissa. Mm-hmm. I haven't seen Angie in a while. Yeah, I didn't know you did it during the newscast. That's very impressive. Wow. <laughs> Right now, we're going to see the to the I love it when weather forecasts are forthcoming. That's awesome. Hmm. Thanks, Dave. You might want to change your travel plans if you use 8th Street in Columbia this week. The city council closed the southbound lane between Broadway and Cherry today for work on the Tiger Hotel. That lane will be open tomorrow and then closed again on Wednesday. You cannot park on the west side of the street, but east so side right spots now. will remain open. And again, that's on 8th Street. Every family with a college student in New York. You know what would be kind of cool is if they showed the rundown. So, Danny, what kind of increase are we talking about here for MU students? You know what would be kind of, yeah, I wonder. So how often does she, okay, so she's plugging into us now. Wow. So, so you should see the rundown. Yeah, it'd be nice if you could. That would be kind of cool, because then we could kind of be following along of what yeah, you're doing. I wonder how I could do that. I'd have to paste know. it in a Google Doc yeah. and then share that screen with the Google Doc. So the screen that I'm sharing over there that you see is me, that's our Plusketeers screen yes, that we just launched. So you can see the people who've donated on that. And usually we'll have our newscast in that thumbnail, but I okay. didn't today just because we just launched that Plus mm. Plusketeers thing. But yeah, that would be neat that you could actually... Um, or yeah. or another thing y'all could try, but then the only yeah. problem with that is you'd lose one of the screens down here. Is have someone film y'all from behind, showing you in the prompter or maybe in the new in the uh, where the producers are. That'd be kind of cool. Yeah. Producers. So show the producers as well as one of the. Well, she just took her earbud out. She can't hear you at the moment. No, I know that. I'm talking with y'all. Oh, sorry. <coughs> so, what I was saying. Bruce, what I was saying is, uh, so like right now, soar to a if we could be in the control room, maybe one of these friends be one of the producers. Hey, one of the that would be really cool. Well, so then you kind of get the, the vibe. Right. Yeah, showing the producers is another angle. would be very fascinating. Because then we can hear what they're saying to her, and you see two sides. So like maybe one of the Google Plus phone and the producers. You'd lose one of these slots, but still, that'd be fascinating. Just a lot. What do you guys think down there? Have any of y'all been in this before? Oh, yeah. Oh. Mm -hmm. yeah. Most of the thing I look Sierra from for months now. Oh, yeah. Cool. That's cool. Yeah. A friend of mine works on the NBC in San Francisco. Hang on. San Jose. Oh, okay. Where are you based there, Chris? I'm out of Dallas. All right. Yeah. So okay, our studio's... It, our mics are gone. If I quit talking, that's because somebody else on the other side of the studio is talking. But I can hear you. I just can't talk. So right. Yeah, all of these people who, you, a, a lot of them who you see in here. And hello, everybody, by the way. Um, <laughs> Hi, Sarah. 
A30 and A31. I, am, I almost want to okay. film. I want to film this. Um, this they've been awesome. here from the beginning, and they can tell you, um, Bruce, Robert, how it works. But this is a behind-the-scenes hang. During our 11 a.m. newscast, we shoot it from two different perspectives. So you're seeing the behind-the-scenes view, okay. like this, okay. in front of our touch screen, and then we display the hangout in a 50-inch touchscreen monitor that we then take that That's thing out on the air. Yeah. Okay. And we're allowed to talk with them um, back and forth. <laughs> that was awesome. Yeah, there's, there's videos. We've done screen captures this in the past. Chris. There's videos up and around that you can see. Okay, this is a Google Plus Hangout right now. Sarah Hill is doing this live. She's trying to anchor hey. the podcast. And watch this. Watch what she's doing here. Okay, now she'll come on during a break and she'll talk with people. This is amazing. That was beautiful ninjing of the earphone out real quick. Did you like that? Hi, Eric Rice. <laughs> and hello, Elaine. Good to see you as well. Hi. Eric, Eric, what are you working on? What are you uh, editing? Pizza right now. <laughs> <laughs> okay, really good. That is only the only thing I am working on is pizza. Look, that is yummy. Funny. That's a good thing to work on. Yeah. Got any pizza I can work on? Come on over, pizza in real life. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I have to add this to my list. I've seen a guy make tacos before, um, and now I can say I've seen a guy during a newscast eat pizza. Hmm. So, that's awesome. Sounds good. Um, if you guys haven't heard about the Plusketeers, let me just bend your ear just uh, um, a little bit about that. It's something that we launched uh, today of officially, and it's a fundraising effort, uh, not only for Pet International, which ma makes carts for people who have to crawl on the ground, but also for a lot of um, different charities out there. And if you go to plusketeers.org, it has all of the backstory. On it, but essentially, when you joined this hangout, you saw that it was sponsored by Midway Electric and Michelle Spry. And um, essentially, she she paid via crowd rise um, and made a donation to um, Pet International. And I think her her charity might have been the Dolly Parton Imagination Library. But um, anyway, she's sponsoring this, that hangout, and we're hoping to raise some funds under the Plusketeers umbrella for some good causes out there. So if you have a cause that you'd like to contribute, you can add it to our Crowd Rise page. And weather's hot now. So this I can hear you, but I can't talk. Brilliant. Absolutely brilliant. I was so happy to, to, to see this thing. It's like when I woke up. I mean, so she right now, as you can see, she's live on on television and interacting with people. It's amazing. And I'm doing a video of this and putting a story together. So this is like four different things going on. No, I'm kind of trying to listen with her. See if we can make her mess up on camera. That'll be awesome. No, Sarah doesn't mess up. As you can see, she's chatting with people while she's trying to do newscasts and also listening to producers. And they're telling her to rap, and she doesn't care because she cares more about her Google Plus Hangout people. This is amazing, folks. <laughs> As we're going live, being recorded via an iPhone. Chris Yates is doing a personal documentary on Sarah's Hill Live broadcast. <laughs> The meta never ends. Hey, PL, what's up, man? I haven't seen you for days. Okay. Now I'm going to upload this here in a minute. This not, awesome. There's some of you here that I see more often than I see my mom. <laughs> Ciao, Benlo. Ciao, everybody. Ciao, Ciao Sarah. Hey, Pio. Pio. Man, Sarah, I thought I could add a little Ciao, Ciao, Eddie. Nice greetings to Italy, Pio. Welcome back, Rodney. I bow down to you, man. Hey, Pio. <laughs> nice Quite greetings to Italy, Pio. How long is the day at your location? <laughs> I'm going to duck out, make room for some other people. Good show, everyone. All right, I'll see you around. Bye, Eric. Bye. Bye.
That was funny, a guy named Rice was eating pizza. <laughs> <laughs> he should eat, have sushi or something. Yeah, there he is in front of this green screen. Mm. That, that's always amazing the way they plant yeah, the ball. Yeah, that is cool. I don't know how they do that. Well, oh, they're looking um, at a monitor. They're I'm looking at a Hallo aus Deutschland. Hallo from Germany. Good weather forthcoming, huh? Sure, you like that word. I love that word. That's my new word. A yearly tradition is helping do more than just put smiles on faces in the bar. Coming out, find out how residents are giving back. Who just nope. joined? Who was that? Who just joined? Oh, hello! I just circled you. Yes, from Germany. But you're yes. in my circles. Thank you. I, is it Lars? No. Yes, thank you very much. Good evening, Sarah. <laughs> yeah, good to see you. You came in on a different page. That's why I didn't um, recognize it. Yeah, your, this, your name is this Lars, is my support right? promotion. Yes, so that's tell right. Me what, tell me what that does then. What what does your page do, or what so do you, what do you do, Lars? As far as your that page, what does that brand page do? Yeah, this support promotion worldwide TV is actually my YouTube, um, and I support YouTube channels. Excellent. So I'm um, I'm I'm care about little YouTube channels and, and uh, promote them with annotation links on my videos. So I everybody gotcha. can uh, get to these uh, great channels around the world. Very cool. So what's news in Germany today? Sorry? What's news in Germany today? What was your big you news? President, you have? Yeah. Because your president resigned not too long ago, right? Yeah. Yeah. What's uh, yesterday? Yeah. Yeah, we have we have carnival uh, in in Cologne. We have a German carnival in Cologne, and this is very big. So uh, I had a time with my family, and um, yeah. Great! It's President's Day here in the U.S., so a lot of people had um, the day off work, but we didn't. Um, it's Loafers Day in our area. There's for the last 52 years they've had something called Lo Loafers Week in a town in Avaz, Missouri, and all they do during that week is sit around a table and eat peanuts and play cards. Right, that's what we call President's Day, Loafer's Day, yeah. right? <laughs> right? Oh, I'm sorry. I, th right, I thought that's Chris. what you were talking about. That's right. Yeah. Bruce, what's going on with you, bud? Nothing. Not much. Oh, you, you back. Um, just the usual. Recorded a show last night and helping Robert brainstorm about hangout here. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we had our first test flight. Bruce is the pilot in the cockpit on the left hand side, and everybody is sitting like this. And then we, we just fasten our seat belt, and so the hang the hangout is a, a little bit like a flight. You have to sit sit for a long time, and the ticket will be ten dollars for plus the tiers. And you have to go through security. So we have our friend Frank that will be part of the security team. And you have to earn your way into the cockpit. Once you get into the cockpit, you can buy either a coach ticket, business class, or first class ticket. She thinks you're crazy, too. I know. <laughs> <laughs> That's the fun part of it, yeah. There is no smoking aboard the plane or in the lavatories whatsoever. Yeah, it's a private jet at the Salt Falcon. It has only 10 seats. 
Angie, well. thanks. The 52nd annual Loafers Week kicked off today in Avaz. The event's purpose? To help beat the community's to, winter blues. Gonna, People gonna from all over Mid-Missouri and the state know. came together to play cards, catch up, and share a hot meal provided by different organizations each day of the week. This year during Loafers Week, catching up has more than one meaning. I, Loafers Week is hilarious to me. I'm sorry. And it's President's Day. It's just so funny. Okay, I want to get her on the news again. It's so fun to watch you do this because half we've been doing it for the past the eight months. Goes to the winner, <laughs> I know. The community I mean, center takes just, the other I'm half. Away by the center hopes to surpass the $100 yeah. profit so it it from right, the man. raffle last year. <laughs> Wish him best of luck with that. That's awesome. Many of you, you speaking up about shots watching? fired at Columbia's Chuck E. Cheese. I, I can't hear you in Sarah's talking. Comment talking. Coming up. Oh, okay. So, Bruce, so, you've already filmed something like this behind the scenes? Oh, yeah. Oh, cool. I want to see it. Yeah, just go to my about page and click on the YouTube link. You can um, see some of the stuff that I've recorded of Sarah. Awesome. And, and some friends in the hangout from from not only here but from the uh, Reynolds School of journalism and other stuff as well. Oh, that's cool. Thanks, man. Yeah. Robert. Okay. Okay. I'm headed to the other side of the studio. Here's Angie Bailey. Hi, guys. Say hello. And Robert. We, I want to get you on air talking about that light thing. I think that that would be great. Yeah. Great. Come here. Ryan, come here. There's a newscast. Oh, hello. What's that, right? Nice to meet you. Nice greetings from Vienna, Austria. Hello. He's This is my son, Ryan. He wants to watch the newscast. Hello, Ryan. Hello from Germany. Hi, Ryan. How you doing, man? Hello from Italy. <laughs> okay, so they're doing a newscast. Well, and, we party, party. Ryan. and then she'll Stop talk to you for the day. news. <laughs> is that wild? Yeah. That is so cool. It's <laughs> the greatest idea I've ever seen. I know. See, here she is right here. Here she is right there. Cool. Angie, you got the earbuds in? I got to get me one of them. So, just so you know, are you, are you new to Hangouts? Chris? I'm sorry? Are you new to Hangouts? Uh, yeah, about two weeks ago. All right, so you know that there's a mute button at the top? I know, sorry. So, so when, you, when you click that, it just mutes yourself but nobody else in the Hangout? And yeah, I did know that. Yeah, okay. Angie, I missed you. <laughs> I need one of those giant cups. Well, thank you, Bruce, for the reminder. Yeah, no I, 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 I should have hit it. Sorry, I'm all over the place but, today. Yeah, I missed you, too. What's busy in there today? How you been? It is. It's a little crazy. I, uh, I've been fine. Great. You busy, look great. Busy. Oh, thank you. I have, uh, what are, are you guys, can you screen share in here? Yeah, you can. How was the weekend, Angie? Busy. I'm going to show you something. I swear to God, that giant touch screen is one of the coolest things I've ever seen. I need one. <laughs> I would have one in every room in my house. <laughs> Just take some money out of the studio behind you. <laughs> So, Robert, are you ready to talk? I don't know if she's going to put you on air today or not. <laughs> That's the local paper today. Wow. My hair's not quite that big. No, not quite. But it was funny. Someone just saw that. I That's haven't seen funny. it yet. Hey, guys, thanks for letting me come on for a sec. I got four kids home. <laughs> <laughs> 
and I don't want to be too loud. So y'all. Good luck to you, sir. Thanks so much. <laughs> All right, Chris, we'll see. We'll see. Nice to meet you, Chris. Hey, thanks. Don't forget to unshare the screen when you're done, Angie. We can see you again. Fifty years ago today marked the blast off. Welcome, and welcome to the sponsor of this hangout. This is KOMU Hello, Michelle. Coverage you can count on. Hello, being a Falcon. <clears throat> yes, now owner of an airline, hangoutair.com. Bruce Garber was my pilot for the first test flight today, and on first of March we have the maiden flight. And afterwards, we have your right. regular flights with a schedule and, and everything an airline has. You are inside a hangout, like in real time, and only if you stay the full time, you collect the miles and everything. <laughs> and first, you have to get a ticket and a boarding pass. You have to get through a security check hangout. If you don't pass it, you have to go through the body scanner. That's, then you have to be in underwear for 10 minutes in a public hangout. <laughs> 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 and the tickets will be $10 for plus yeah, I love that. But it all depends on which, which ticket you buy. It depends if you're in coach, economy, uh -huh. business class, or first class. The price goes up, of course. Yeah. Wow. That's very good. So if you're coach, do you have more turbulence or something like that? Yeah, everything that can happen on a flight can happen here. So if someone has to exit, he can use the parachute, but then he will collect no miles. So. So where, where are some of the places where you'll be, like what are the destinations or like what will you be doing for entertainment on the flight? Yeah, the destinations are cities like Vienna and New York where I have my own photo material and then photographers can join and they give me their uh, photos for slideshows with their names in it and so they get exposure and I have content for all the cities around the world. That is so cool. That is an awesome idea. Are you ready to give Sarah the, the 15 to 20 second demonstration? Demonstration? Yeah, we're almost done with the news. If you can wait like two minutes and we can do it after the news and I can see. Or if you've got, you got time, Robert. Yes, uh, but I, I, I can talk to you about it, but I do not have now uh, a concept or anything. It was just created two hours ago. Oh, you're kidding me. That's awesome. I love it. You need to hire stewardesses and I wonder what else. I mean, what else happens at the airport? Yeah, the, the flight attendant selects and everything, yeah. Mm-hmm. You get your bags, you check your luggage. Go through security. Yeah, you can show your luggage. Yeah, you get a pillow or a blanket. Get the security instruction, fasten your seatbelt. <laughs> well, as long as there's not like a big PSA. You know, have to st store your baggage in the overhead bin, overhead bin and all this stuff. Robert, don't, don't forget, you've got to get your oxygen mask down from, yes, the, for sure. from the ceiling. In case of loss of cabin pressure, there will be <laughs> oxygen mask released to you. First use it for yourself and then, only then, <laughs> help your children. <laughs> <laughs> We've been working on this all afternoon. <laughs> I love it. That's an awesome, I mean seriously, that's an awesome con. No, Sarah froze. Let's let's give it a try. Everybody has to sit sit like this. So Sarah is already correct, and so everybody has to sit like this. Bruce is the captain in the cockpit on the left hand side. <laughs> no, uh, that's that's the wrong direction. You see yourself in the mirror. Oh. Yeah. So well, you have to Sarah, turn to the right. Sarah's oh, right. Hold on, they're Sarah's standing by. Correct. Michelle, the other way. Oh, the other way. Yeah. Oh, good. Yeah. The, the other way. You are, you are mirrored for Jackson, yourself. Jackson, the other way, please. Pio, the other way. Pio, the other way. Pio, turn around. <laughs> and um, support promotion down the other way also, please. Hey, that, does that mean I'm in first class? <laughs> I'm in first yes, class. Yes, the, 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 promo the promotion guy from Germany, yes, turn the other way. Okay. okay. Well, Mr. Jackson, right direction. Oh, well, Mr. Jackson, turn the other way. What, what? Yep, just turn around. Like this? Okay. Yep. yep. Well, now I'm in the wrong way. No, no, listen. Michelle, please oh. stay the way you were. Yes. Please stay the way you were. <laughs> Yes, sir. Now turn right. You. You're, you're like a great this? image, so everybody, everybody just look look forward. I'm going to do a screen cap of this. Nice big smile from Sarah. She's, she's, uh, she can't hear us. Hold, hold the shot. I'm going to do it anyway. <laughs> See if you can hold those. Is it right like this? 
Yes, everybody is correct. If you can just hold those hold those positions just for a minute till Sarah comes back. She doesn't have her earbud in yet, so I want to be able to get her when she comes back. I want to get her to smile. Yeah, it's okay. She, yeah, I she's have, sitting correctly. It's okay. I have my reading material to bring with me on the uh, plane. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I want to be ready for a screenshot, please. Thank you. Okay. Bruce, Bruce, can you also turn a little bit? No, the other direction, or that you see it correctly. Oh, goodness. It lasted just 15 minutes. It was on the third mission. Yeah, it must be correct on your screen, Bruce. You're ready now? Today, robots... And uh, also, hold those positions just for a minute. I'm just trying to get Sarah to smile. <laughs> that, that's all part of it. To it's again. Sorry. That, that's, that's all part of it. It's annoying like a real flight. The new legislation <laughs> could change the way that parents handle missing children. It's called Kaylee's Law. It is named after Kaylee Anthony, who went missing in July 2008. Dave, uh, keep it up, okay? 50s, we can handle it in February. Just a minute, just hold those positions, please, just for a moment. 50s forthcoming. Not a problem, man. Right? I'm loving that. Just trying to make sure my position's right. I know, that might have to be our passion. Okay, Robert, but you must tell me that again, right? Everybody's good. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Everybody's good. Let's hold those positions. Hey, Sarah. Oh, I've got to get a screenshot. Hold on. Yeah, let me Sarah, if you can just face in that, no, the other way, Sarah. The, oh, this way? <laughs> yep, yep. Just sit that way, and I'm trying to grab a couple screenshots. I'm trying to get. I'm a the wrong way, aren't I? You. Should Angie and I both go this way? Should yeah, you yeah, yeah. Closer to me. Can you back up a little bit? We're yeah. on a plane. Yeah, Angie has the AL seat. Yeah. I want to be able to see Angie's face a little bit. Okay. Yeah, well, Bruce, can I also have yeah. one with me, green box, please? Yeah. <laughs> Hold on, one more. One more. Oh my God. And are we good? Cheese. Hold on. What are we doing? It's, oh, you got to hear this. A pet flight on hangout there. Big smile. Big smile. Are you good? Yeah, I think we are. Okay, you got to seriously, you got to hear this. This this is awesome. He has a concept for it's called Hangout on Air, and but it's, yeah, it's a plane. Uh, tell her, tell her about it. Yeah, it's the first virtual Hangout airline, so it's HangoutAir.com, and uh, <laughs> we will schedule schedule <laughs> flights. You have to be in the Hangout for the full time with with the and then you collect the miles, and it goes first. You go to a security check Hangout. Uh, th where you have to make the security check. If you don't pass it, you have to go to the body scanner, which means you have to be in underwear in a 10-minute public hangout. <laughs> if, if you get your boarding pass and everything, then you are in invited to the flight itself. And uh, we fly from Vienna to New York. The maiden flight is on 1st March of uh, 2012 um, at zero hours UTC. And the, during the flight, we will show photos from Vienna and New York, the cities that we are oh, traveling to. And cool. photographers can join and can give material. They get exposure. And uh, the tickets will be $10 for plus the tiers. That's, That's awesome. Really clever. Did Isn't you feel that? that on the fly, or have you been thinking about that for a while? Yeah, and then we make co-chair flights with all on-air hangout owners. They are the pilots then in the cockpit. So, Robert, let's give her the demonstration like you did before. Get yourself into that co-pilot position. Yes. Yeah, so, uh, fasten your seatbelt, please. Of course, thank you. <coughs> make 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 sure that your tables are in the upright position. Your seats are pulled back, and uh, luggage yeah. is stowed underneath the seat or in the overhead bucket behind you. I've heard it all. Stewardesses and cabin crew, please take your Flight seats attendant. and prepare yourself for the takeoff. But don't forget about the oxygen. We'll drop down if you need it. And you place it over the mouth like this. <laughs> At first, take the oxygen yourself and then right. help your kids. Uh -huh. That's right. That is awesome. So, so, Robert, are you ready? Ready with the, the camera? Yeah. Like you did before? So do that. We're going we're gonna to take off, ladies and gentlemen. Okay. Can you hold on? Prepare yourself for takeoff. That's so exciting. Well, I mean, with the, with the, with the camera, Robert, we're going to take off. Remember like we did this afternoon? Ah, one moment, please. I have to find the, the image. And I mean yeah. the, the, the shaking of your camera as we roll down the runway. Ah, yeah, sorry, sorry, sorry. 
Um, why is that much? We need turbulence from Steve Aoki. Yeah. yeah. Oh my god, I don't find it. Yeah. <laughs> One moment, please. Uh, we have a technical problem with the plane. I don't want to be on that plane with no technical problem. That's right. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is your co-pilot, Robert Riddle speaking. Uh, the flight plan has been changed by the authorities, and we have to wait for another 10 minutes. Uh, thank you for your patience. Oh, my. I want a <laughs> refund. <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> okay, here we go for the takeoff. Please, yeah, everybody, fasten your seatbelts. <laughs> I'm so scared about flying. <laughs> if I didn't know the context of what we were doing, Sarah, I would have serious questions for you right now. Oh, turbulence, my friend. All, all turbulence on him. I know, I know. Yeah, the whole flight. <laughs> the most terrible flight I've ever had. I'm just, I'm just saying. I'm just yeah. putting that out there. <laughs> that is awesome, Robert. I love it. With sound effects and everything. Yeah, that's that's really cool. It'd be really interesting to see what photographers you would have, all the different places that they could take you, and you know if you had even someone like with a, a mobile hotspot and a laptop out on the streets of you know Vienna or Italy. wherever that would Italy that would be fascinating too. Yeah, there's mm -hmm. so much material out there. And then on, on the website, we could make uh, a real-time flight plan and everything that you see boarding in 30 minutes and all this stuff, then you have no problems with the announcements. We've actually done that, Sarah, where, where, where our friend Hugo from Italy had his iPad and was showing us around some very popular places in Italy, short little five-minute clips. Of course, we couldn't do it on air because you can't join an on-air hangout from an iPad, but I was able to capture it the old way and then reshare those YouTube, you know, turn it in and upload it to YouTube and reshare it that way. Recorded from an iPad in a Hangout. Yeah, that's awesome. Yeah, we've done that already. That's cool. Yeah. Neat stuff. Well, I'm excited about it. It's March 1st, right? Yes. For all of those, those watching. That's okay. easy to remember. March the 1st, zero hours UTC, we start the maiden flight. So this was the first, uh, one of the first test flights we joined together. Yeah, this, this was the yeah. second test flight today. Oh, yeah. Very cool, it's very cool. And so what's the name of the airline again? Hangoutair.com Okay. okay. Hangout and are there snacks on this flight? Do we have pretzels and, and peanuts? Yes, uh, it's, it's a very economy-oriented uh, flight because it's running for charities also, so you have to bring your snacks yourself. <laughs> <laughs> and be prepared that everybody has a belt and some accessories for the flight <laughs> that you want to have. you got to bring your own belt, of course. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. Bring I love that. Parachute, flight suit. This is the kind of fun we have in Hangouts every day, sir. I know, and I, I always am working, so I miss all your fun. Uh, not all of it. You're, you're a big fan of a lot of it. Well, that's, that's cool. I can't so, wait. When you, uh, I so, we totally so need to get this on you news, so whenever you do your um, maiden flight, or whenever you're ready to talk about it and have some visuals that you can um, talk about it, let me know, because we'll, we'll get you on that. That'd be a total, yes, total for great sure. story. On, on that day, we will schedule a flight from Colombia to New York, for example. Yeah? Okay. Hey, or Robert. from, from Colombia to LA, because afterwards we can jump, jump to my Fox 11. Or, and we will also have flights from one TV station to the other. Hey, Robert, real quick, do you have that slideshow queued up that you can just give Sarah 30, 40 second taste of what we did in New York in a slideshow fashion? Uh, what do you mean, the photos? Or yeah, yeah, that photo slideshow that you, we were sharing this afternoon. I have, yeah, a, a taste. It's like I know there's about five or six hundred pictures in there. It'll, it'll take a couple hours to get through it, but you can just show her thirty seconds of it. Yeah. So the, the idea was that I can use the photo content because you, I, t I took one thousand four hundred images uh, in New York, but there can't, there are only twenty or thirty images. Are coming out that are good, and so I I'm simply uh, then br browsing through the images and have had an automated slideshow running, 
and I was thinking about setting up a, a virtual world, like that you can meet the location and you can hang out in, in New York. But uh, there it is. <coughs> but the, f the flights, the flights are maybe uh, more appealing uh, to reflect the, the hangout situation that you are sitting and we we go together from one event to the to the other event and stuff like that. So, and we can play all the aviation memes and the fun stuff that al already exists and uh, build it into the the whole story. Mm -hmm. Because they're beautiful. Yeah, so the slideshow would normally be automated and then you have every five seconds an image. And I saw that it's quite uh, attracting because you, you do not want to leave the hangout because you want to see the next picture and the next one and the next mm -hmm. one. And if a photographer gives me lower resolution images with a big watermark with his name, this, this could be quite a huge uh, collection. Because everybody is making photos like this, you run through the city, make 2,000 images, and then you select out the good ones, but the rest is never used. And I could maybe even get the content from big photographers uh, when they, they share their B content, so to say. Yeah, I wonder if you could do even um, like documentary screenings or something like that as well. I mean, you have an in-flight movie. Yeah, you know, sure. I'm, oh, I'm sure there are, you know, <laughs> documentaries like the True False Film Festival is big in Colombia, and people are always wanting to get forums for their their documentaries. And I bet you'd find mm -hmm. um, a lot of people might be willing to share that for I a donation. Yeah, that'd be cool. Mm -hmm. And, and yeah, what you do is you highlight that particular ph photographer or filmmaker or whatever for, you know, that half hour or an hour or whatever case it happens to be. You know. Mm -hmm. Love it. You guys it from a marketing standpoint, but yeah, I'm. You guys are so creative. That's awesome. I I can't wait. I'm excited about it. It's so Rob, cool. It's Robert's idea. Very neat. Pia, what's going on with you in Italy? Um, as far as news are concerned, uh, yeah. mm -hmm. uh, we have two major uh, issues here uh, tonight. One is with uh, they are not very good news, though. One is with the um, two. Um, Military who have been arrested in India for shooting two fishermen. I don't know if you heard of that. And uh, three soldiers in Afghanistan who just had an accident and they died. Mm -hmm. These are uh, the, the main uh, news that are holding the, 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 mm -hmm. the, the main uh, stream tonight. In Italy. Gotcha. Well, if I'd, I'd like to. Um, close by just telling anybody who's watching on the stream if you would check out pluscateers.org um, that would be great there's a blog post on there that tells you a little bit about the organization um, but if you would share that site um, that would be awesome if you can see this thumbnail down there we've already got uh, $1,365 and there's donations scrolling down there and thank you Michelle Spry for being our hangout sponsor yay Michelle and um, Midway Midway Electric, uh, MidwayElectricInc.com, is that right? It is. Yeah. So thanks for that. And to everybody who does it an anonymously. Absolutely. Everybody who does it anonymous as well. You bet. Hey, guys, I'm going to head back into the newsroom. It's great to see you. It's, I hope you enjoyed your flight. This was a great <laughs> flight. Yeah. I'll just Thank you. This is my destination safely. Yes, I'm going to edit some of that on YouTube and put put that up, Robert, if that's okay. I just think your little demonstration that was awesome. Yeah, thank you very much. So, but the star of the show is is Michelle as being one of the first sponsors of the show. Absolutely, we're in this together, guys. That electric. <laughs> All right, guys. Well, have a wonderful evening. It's good to see all of you. Bye, guys. Take care, Sarah. Bye, bye. bye. Take care. Bye. 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 Thank you.